Hey guys, what's going on? It's iPod Apps Freak. Um, basically, I just woke up right now. Um, and I decided I would make another video since it is Saturday, and I'm trying to get you guys um, more videos so you guys are not bored on my channel. So this video is um how to make uh, how to stop Cydia from crashing. Now this is a huge problem, and some people on YouTube do not know how to do it properly. And in this video, I'm going to teach you how to do it without SSHing into your iPhone or iPod Touch. Um, so here I have iFile. Make sure you have iFile downloaded. Um, so open up Cydia. And once you um do uh, after this video, um, uh, your Cydia is going to load a lot faster because it's not going to download all those packages and all of that. So. Um, and also this will delete all of your sources and if you add one source let's say you add the mod my source or you see that you see, just watch how fast it loads there you go no reloading no reloading time or anything so how to download iFile um, make sure you have the sinful iPhone repo source which I'll have in the description and go down to the i i file cracked and that's how you get it free install it confirm it and you're done so after that um you want to open up i file and this is the proper way how to do it um and this will delete all of your sources so you should add one source all right go all the way back to the slash all right go down to var let me zoom in here for you guys lib lib apt lists and you want to delete all the lists instead of the partial folder instead of this folder delete everything that you have over here because these are all your packages and these are the ones that make Cydia crash and all of that so once you have that done I'm not going to do it because I already did it um, earlier today so then you want to go open up Cydia and you're going to notice that it's a lot faster and um, it's just like how it runs on the iPhone 4 you know how smooth it is on the iPhone 4 and this should stop your Cydia from crashing so um after it's done loading hold on all right all right after it's done loading which was pretty fast I'm gonna go over to manage sources and you're gonna see that you have no sources installed so what you're gonna do is you're gonna add uh, any source I'm just gonna just add the um sinful iPhone repo source which is right there just add that after you did done the steps that I told you guys and then you'll have all of your sources back and you will be ready to go no reloading on Cydia or anything it is fast as hell and as you see so smooth now um, everything is working perfectly fine the sources are opening faster than before no lag at all you see that so that will that was how to hold on well I shouldn't have done that but um anyways whatever um so anyways that, that was how to uh, make Cydia uh, stop from crashing and also speed it up a bit um so yeah guys, thank you guys for watching. It's iPod Apps Freak. And I'll see you guys in the next one. If you guys are not following me on Twitter, please follow me on Twitter. Uh, uh, because I do update my Twitter every day with one tweet or two tweets or something like that. So yeah guys, thank you guys for watching. It's iPod Apps Freak. Peace.